Hello friends, this is William with Sharpsoft here. Just wanted to show you the Sharpsoft estimator and how easy it is once a bid is complete that you can get that information out to an Excel export if that's what you want. So if I just go to job, bid items, job as it's going has all of the items that we bid. Again, this is a demo job. It's a cost of 4 million. It's a bid total of 4.9 million. I right click and I want to go export to Excel and so we can drag individually if we want. If we have a format that we like, I can hit load format and I want overall cost, no fuel. So I double click that and now notice it has brought all of that other information from the report that I've ran before. So I want to map the header rows and I want to hit start export and then I'm just going to call this test export 7 24 24 it's in my documents, I can put it in my web folder. Right there, there it is, I hit save. And notice that export is there. Now if I go to my file, so I just, I have it open on another screen, but here is that export that we just had. There's the groups, the description, the man hours, the bid quantity, there's the actual cost and total cost. We can just go down the line. There's the rounded total. There's my total material cost. There's my total labor cost. All the way down to overall cost codes if that's what you want. So that information is there. It's great. So now let's just come back. I don't want to save that. Let's come back into the job and say I want to right click and then now I want to export from Excel again. And so what I want to do is I want to load a format. So there's that no fuel, right? So it brings everything over. Notice there's that all of those items again. And now let's just say for here, for the owned equipment and the rented equipment, I have options down here that I want to add. There is the owned equipment fuel. So I'm going to bring this down one, and then I'm going to go owned equipment fuel. Save that right there, and then rented equipment fuel. I bring that right here. And then now what I want to do is I want to save this format again, and I'm just going to call it with fuel. So now I have two different exports that are ready to go. I hit that start export and I'll go test export with fuel and now it's pulling all of that information out again. So once we have that exported again we can most certainly grab that. It's on my other screen so I move it over notice now we have that same export but what we also have now is the rental equipment fuel and we also have that owned equipment fuel so very easily we were able to open those up get that saved in and now every time I go and have that report to go to Excel those loaded formats I can have in there as I have to be able to just load them automatically anytime that I want them so Again, the estimator is working to save you time, save you money. Let us know if you're looking to save time and save money. We love you guys. We'll talk to you later. God bless.